Hi, welcome to an early edition of The Road to 40, featuring me, Jason Oliveira, in case you didn't know. Uh, got a little package in the mail today, so this is my second ever unboxing video. This is exciting, because boxing and unboxing video... Boxing videos would be boring, unless it was actual boxing. And I'm not going to box anybody on The Road to 40, hopefully. Uh, yeah, boxing videos would not be fun. Unboxing, however, has become a trend. A weird trend. I agree with it, though. I like it. I like seeing new things being opened and what's in the package. <laughs> I love opening packages. Like this one right here. Well, a few days ago, <clears throat> we made the decision to stay with Verizon and go with their new Verizon Edge plan, which isn't a really good deal, but both our phones suck. We have no money. <laughs> so we were able to pay them off and uh, over the course of time. And you can upgrade sooner, and you're not actually technically obligated to a contract. I think it's like a one year or something like that. So, uh, without further ado, why don't we bust into this dirty bitch. Um, I've already actually opened the seals of the package, I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> um, let's take a look at the contents. Oh, what is this? Oh, look at that. You have to start here. <laughs> I can't start in there, I have to start here, so let's push this over and take a look. Using materials, blah, 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 words, before turning on your device, yada, 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 return label. Yeah, you do have to return your phone if you're still under contract, which kind of sucks. So that's just the billing stuff, and I'm sure it's how to set the phone up initially. Ooh, some nice thick bubble wrap. The kids will have fun with that, but there's three, which means Grayson and Griffin are probably going to fight over this. Uh, although Carol has a new phone, too. So, in that case, they will each get... Three. Additionally, in this package, we have... Uh, that's Spanish. I don't speak Spanish so well. I need to learn Spanish, though. It's important. I'd like to learn it. Instructions on how to pack it up. Good thing, because I don't know how to put phones in bags. <laughs> Alright, let's just get to the meat of this bitch. Get rid of that box. And here it is. The Samsung Galaxy S5. Um, this is the first Samsung phone I've ever had. I've always had either... Um, well, my last one was a Motorola, which I don't like Motorola phones. I've had two Motorola phones in my life. Never been a big fan of them. They're not terrible phones. I'm just not a big fan of them. Um, yeah, nice little box. Nice little wood grain packaging. It's got a five on it because it's the fifth one in the series. A little slip case. Some nice information on the back. No, it's not unimportant. Completely unimportant. All right, let's take a look. You ready for this? Oh, oh dear Lord. Oh God, oh dear Jesus, oh Christ in heaven. It's always nice to smell the factory it came from. And here is, uh, okay, so I guess the phone is the first thing to come out here. It's sizable, it's a large phone. There's no battery in it yet because it's very light. That's not bad though, I think I can get used to that size. See, this is, let's do a size comparison. This is the Droid Razor Max versus the Samsung Galaxy S5. Probably about the same depth. Maybe this is this is probably a little thinner. It's got a little bit, bit of a textured back, which I prefer over this. Although that's Kevlar, from what I understand. I would have liked to have kept it, so I could have put it over my heart when I'm out fighting crime. But I have to return it, or pay $200. So there's the phone. I'm not going to take any of this stuff off yet, because I take great pleasure in removing that. Oh, goodness, it's, it's nearly orgasmic. Let's look a little deeper in the box, see what we got here. Okay, we're, we've taken out this layer. There's a little notch in here for my finger, I'm assuming. I hope there's not a scorpion or something in there. Oh, that's nice. Getting to know your phone. All right. Wow. Other languages. Global support. Important consumer information. And product safety warranty. Let's see if I can slip this back in here. Somebody had to do this. Maybe a machine did it. Do you think it's a machine or a man? Yeah. Screw it. We'll do that later. Actually, I'll probably never use that stuff. Set of... I'm sure these are shitty headphones. But right now I have no headphones. Actually, it's a headset, I think. Looks like it's got a mute button and a uh, volume up and down. That's pretty nice. Different size little rubbery things for my baby ears. And then for my big ear. Big ear? Little ear. Yeah. I have weird ears and a... Well, I have a weird shaped skull and strange ears. Now, this is interesting. Because I ordered the charcoal gray phone, but I got a white adapter, wall adapter, and white headphones. You wouldn't think that they would do that. Oh no. Oh no, Samsung, why? Oh, please tell me I'm wrong. Look at that. 
propitiatory. How do you say that word? I don't know. That's really aggravating. It's not a standard plug, it doesn't look like. I'll have to take a look at the phone. Very upset by that. Bad. Bad Samsung. Bad. Um, and the battery. So there's the uh, contents of the box. Unless there's secrets underneath it. I don't see any secrets, so... Um, yeah, so let's set this aside. Take one more look at the battery. It's freaking huge. I do, I do like this about the phone, too, because with the Droid Razor Max, you did not get a removable battery, which was kind of shitty. The battery was good for <clears throat> the first, like, six months. I could literally go three days if I had to without charging it. Um, I always charge it, though, because I just never know. You never know when you're going to need a full charge, when you're going to be on the phone for 12 hours. <laughs> the talk times are so ridiculous on these versus the standby times. The standby times like nine years and like the talk times like 10 minutes or <laughs> something crazy like that. So as long as you're not using your phone, you're all set. Anywho, that's the Samsung Galaxy S5. Uh, I've got to order a case for it. If anybody has a suggestion for a good fake case for this phone, that'd be great. This, this phone, I'm really excited about a few things about this phone. Uh, not the heart monitor, because I don't care. Um, it's the 4K recording that I'm very interested in. There is no image stabilization, so if I do any recording with this, it's going to have to be on a tripod or something to hold it steady. Uh, I probably won't do a lot, because from what I understand, you need a pretty good micro SD card with fast transfer speeds. So eventually I will get one of those. And this does support up to 128 gigabyte card, which is crazy. <laughs> my first hard drive in my first computer was 210 megs. Megs. That's right. Uh, well, I guess I'm going to go through the startup process of this. I'm going to play with this a little bit today. And tonight on the Road to 4 hopefully, if not tonight, maybe tomorrow, I will do a review of the Samsung Galaxy S5, let you know what I think about it. Uh, yeah. So thanks for checking this out, the unboxing video, not the boxing video. Um, I'll see you guys tonight on another episode of The Road to 40. I hope you guys have a great day. Okay, keep smiling. Make someone else smile. Make yourself a better person today. Let's make the world spin a little happier together. Take care. I'm Jason Oliveira. This is The Road to 40.